It's that boiling crab. What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? What's up? Hey, let me know if you bet on the Lakers game. Let me know if you bet on the Lakers game today. Let me know if you bet on the Lakers today. I'm just curious to see if you bet on the Lakers. Okay, okay, we got hell now. Nope. <laughs> Marlita said Lakers in seven. <laughs> it's funny. Um, oh, I got a question. Who, who, who likes to bet on sports? Who likes to bet on sports? Who likes to bet on sports? And, and the reason I ask that is because we, we are quick to bet on sports, but we are not quick to bet on ourselves. Okay? You, you need to bet on yourself. All right, if it's the last shot of the game, you got to take it. You know what I mean? Like, don't bet on sports if you got bad credit. Don't bet on sports if you got no property. You know, don't bet on sports if you, you don't got your stuff figured out. You know? Always bet on yourself. Mar Marlita, that sounds like, is that a male or a female? It's not, oh, Marlita Ray. So I'm assuming you're a dude. Um, yeah, always bet on yourself, guys. You know, I'm working with FICO Father soon because of you. Oh, cool, man. Hit him up. Hit him up. Oh, female. Marlita, eh? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. All right, who wants to come on real quick? We'll do a little, little, little credit, credit, um, como se dice, a little credit game show. All right, a little credit game show. And uh, if you want to hop on, hop on for sure. The winner will win. Uh, we'll do 50 bucks, 50 bucks giveaway. Two people. I'm going to ask them some credit questions. First one to get three answers right. You know, they win. What's up? The Rosa show. What channel is your show on, the Rosa? Que canal? Que canal? 34, 22. Do you come on out after Jose Luis sin censura? What's up? Come on, plug your show. You got to plug your show. Um, so who wants to come on the credit show? Who wants to come on? Who wants to come on the credit show right now? We'll do two or three people. Ask you guys some credit questions. And uh, okay, okay. El Gallo. El Gallo Iselde. Okay. There you go. Request to come on, bro. I, you know, ain't going to be that easy. Come on, Marlita, eh? Come on, you moved to Denver. Let's get it. Let's get it. It's all right, girl. I hope you got painted eyebrows like me. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just fucking with you guys, man. Just know if I, if I clown you guys, I, I, I got love for you guys. You know what I mean? If you can't dish it, take it. If you can't take it, don't dish it, right? Is that how it is? All right, so let's keep, come on, come on. We got one, we got one more, one specimen. El Gallo, El Gallo Elizalde, Elizalde. I bet you he watched the movie Blood and Barrow and he said, hey, I'm going to name myself El Gallo for Instagram. You know, so come on, come on. Let's get it. Come on, guys. It's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to spice up your Saturday night. Trust me. This game show. You'll win 50 bucks, you know? Last time, I think, who won? Uh, her name was, I forgot what her name was, but she, it was a female that won. All you got to do is come on. Come on the game show. Um, request to come on. We got two people, hopefully a girl and a dude, and then we'll ask some credit questions. And, you know, the main, the main point is for the listeners to learn something. While we play a game. All right, guys. This is Saturday night. If you're chilling at home and you want to learn some credit shit, get the book. And the winner will also get the book, too. So you'll, you'll win 50 bucks. 
and and the book. You'll win 50 bucks and the book. All you got to do is come on to the Latino credit show. Okay, look at that. Let me see real quick. Let me invite Marlita. And uh, she rocking her colors, so I respect that. If you guys know. Okay, okay. Hello. What? Oh, okay, Marlita in the building. <laughs> now, now, now it's about to get spicy. See, there you go. So, I'm Marlita. very nervous, but I'll play along. <laughs> oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's all good. It's all good. Hey, El Gallo, what, what's your name, bro? I don't want to call you El Gallo. Elizalde. That's Elizalde. your name? Elizalde. Elizalde, that's your name? Yes. Okay, cool, cool, cool. cool. All right, cool. We'll start off. We'll do uh, ladies first, okay? So, yeah, hey, yeah. real quick, no Google. This is for 50 bucks. First one of three points, you will uh, win 50 bucks. I'll sell you, and you'll get the book if you don't have the book, cool. all right? Anyway, so, all right, we'll go We'll go with um, Marlita first, okay? Yeah. Now, uh, questions are going to be easy, medium, hard, okay? So, first question is, uh, I need you to name the three credit bureaus. Experian, Equifax, and TransUnion. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, cool. hey. Quick little, quick little point right there. Quick little point. <laughs> all right, all right, Ellie. Solid. Okay, cool. Now, um, okay, okay. What is the lowest credit score someone can have, Ellie Salde? The lowest credit score. The lowest credit score? Yeah, what is their lowest credit score someone can have? Uh, insufficient file, a zero. Okay, okay, hey, I I like that. I like that. No, no score, but there ha there's a score. It goes from <laughs> okay. one score to the highest of another score. I don't want to give that away, but uh, <laughs> he said insufficient file, so zero. Um, can you at least throw a number out there so you can be closer to zero? Yeah, I, I can. Let me see here. Um... Hey, 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 no, no, no okay. help from the audience. <laughs> you, you guys can just fuck them up. This ain't no freaking. Uh, Lifelines and shit. <laughs> I, I think I think last time I seen a credit score, uh, that probably be in the three three hundred. Ah, uh, this guy googled it. That, he trying to be slick with it. He, right? He trying to be slick with it right now, bro. Look at that. I, I'm oh. on my phone. I'm 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 doing a uh, workout right here. Okay, okay. So you didn't Google it? No, no, no. I'm on my phone here. I only got my phone here. I got you. I got you. Okay, three hundred. I'll take that. All right. So we got one one. Okay, cool. One one. Sorry. All right. So lowest credit score three hundred. Highest credit score eight fifty. Okay, uh, Marlita said three credit bureaus, Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax, okay? All three, each bank pulls from different ones. I'll give you an example. The Apple card pulls from TransUnion. The Bank of America card, credit card pulls from Experian. You know, this, this type of information you want to know, so when you apply for a credit card, you're in the best possible position, okay? All right, so we're going to go next question. Uh, Marlita. Can what is okay? So this is a trick, not trick question, but like, what is the youngest age you can add an authorized user to a credit card? What what is the youngest age that you you can add? Like, let's say a kid. I'll just make it easier. What is the youngest age you can add a kid to a credit card? Hmm. I want to say 17, but I think it's younger than that. Um, come on, come on. Hey, 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 don't, don't, don't. Yeah, yeah. Keep looking that way. Don't look at the, you don't want them to mess you up. <laughs> you want me to... Um, 15? No, no, no. So as long as they have a social, <sighs> some banks, no, no, no. Some banks will let you add them. So for example, Navy Federal will let you add them as long as they have a social. Okay. 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 Now. Uh, Bank of America, no, I'm sorry, Capital One, same thing, as long as they have a social. Amex, they have to be 13. Okay. They discover, they have to be 15. So it's certain. Okay. Certain cards have certain age limits, but like Capital One, and I said, um, and uh, Navy Federal, as long as they got a social, you can add them to your card. Now, 
for for you guys watching, right? Like, like honestly, I know people say, uh, but I, I, I've said, add your kid to the credit card as long as you teach them the good and the bad about credit. It's not just adding them; it's going to improve their credit score. But they can get the same effect if you add them at 16 or if you add them at one, because you're adding your years of your credit card to their file. Okay, so it's not like if he if you add him since he was two, it doesn't mean he'll have 20 years of credit when he's 18 or something. Got okay? it. Yeah. So, okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, so we got one, one. All right, next question. And uh, like I said, it's medium. So what does FICO stand for? Uh. <laughs> what does FICO stand for? No, 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 it's for Margarita. Oh, um, Fair Isaac Corporation. It's two men's names, right? Oh, okay, 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 yeah, yeah. They created the algorithm for it. I just listened to your podcast today. That's why I know. <laughs> oh, nice. Which one? Um, um, you. I think you did an interview with Nico. Yeah. Okay, nice. Okay, cool, cool. So, just so I can give you guys the 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 names, because I I messed up the second one, and uh, the names of the founder is. Bill Fair and Earl Isaac. Earl. So it's Bill Fair and Earl Isaac. They founded the FICO score in 1956. Okay. okay? Now, um, it was just, like I said, they, they comprised an algorithm to come out with a score, and that's how they came with the FICO score. Now, now this is interesting. So you got that. Somehow you got that right. So she got two points. So... Um, Isalde, what is Credit Karma? What score do they use? Because they don't use FICO. They use something else. What do what do they use? Credit Karma? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so they, they don't use FICO. They use something else. It's a different scoring model for credit. I believe it's a Vantage score, right? Um, oh, shit, okay. Okay, yeah, yeah. Vantage what, though? Vantage. Uh, Vantage FICO? No. Right, or was it? Vantage 3.0. Yeah, the Vantage 3.0. Yeah, right. Yeah, so what happened? Who invented that score? The three credit bureaus, they came together and they invented that score. So that's so like a hybrid? Like a hybrid of all of them combined? Yeah, and it, and it pushes the algorithm like... It bumps you up a little bit more. So if you go right now on your Credit Karma and you see your TransUnion score, it's like, maybe, let's say, for example, it's like 650. For example, your real FICO might be 620. Right. Okay? Right, right. And I, what right. I find, is, is, it, is it typically higher than, than, um, than uh, typically higher than like an Experian or a TransUnion? Yes, exactly. Uh, you know, because so, we all... Don't we go off seen, Credit Karma. Yeah. Okay. 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 Do not go off Credit Karma. Do not go off Credit Karma. All right, cool. So next question. So he got that one. I mean, you know, I'll give it to him because he did say Vantage score. Um, so I'll give it to him. So, But it's Vantage score 3.0. So we're tied, 2-2. Two, two. All right, so this one, A, make it or break it, okay? So let me see. Um, okay, because... Name the five factors of credit. Okay. Oh, God. Utilization, um, mixed accounts, usage, history, and, and... One more, one more. You got this. Oh, God. I look at this all the time. It's because I'm nervous. <laughs> Um, utilization, credit mix. Oh, I can't remember the fifth one. I know it's 30, 35%, 30%, 10, 10, and, and 15. Yeah, yeah, age. that's good, but Credit age. Yeah, credit age, length of history. Oh, God. Okay, good. You got it, you got it. So look, so she got to three. So I'm going to give you, you the one more opportunity. If you get to three... Then, then obviously it's 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 a it's a fight for all. 
Okay, so you have one more opportunity to get to three real quick. All right, so let's go with, um, okay. Which is the number one credit union nationwide? What's it called? What's the bank called? The number one credit union nationwide? Yeah, number one, like the, the one with the most money. I talk about it every time, man. I, I should it's be. It's gotta be. It's got. I, I know. I know. It's gotta be Navy Fed. Damn! It's like someone's whispering. <laughs> <laughs> right? You, you, you talk about it all the time. No, no, it is. It is. It is Navy Fed, man. It is. But it I feels like somebody, somebody whispers to me. Yeah, Navy Fed. So okay, cool. So we're three, three. Damn. Three, three. Oh. I didn't know it was gonna be like. You're, okay, man. You're a good teacher. You taught us all this, brother. I I need harder questions then. No. <laughs> Okay, uh, how about this? How about this? All right, can you show me one method of how to liquidate a credit card? How to liquidate I, a credit card? So how can to I take, take that? No, <laughs> how to take the cash from the credit card? You, you can go as as basic as to the number one reason we shouldn't do it. There's many ways to take cash out of a credit card, and I'll just name one. And you get the point. You can go to ATM and do it. There you go. There you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Cash advance. Yeah. Which, mm -hmm. which is something that I don't really recommend. Cash no. advances. You know? But, but okay, okay, cool. So he's one. Uh, El Elizalde, uh, name another one. Uh, you can buy the $500 gift card visas using your, cre uh, using your credit card. And then go ahead and get a, um, a money order from Western Union to cash that and get cash. Ooh, damn, this guy's been either watching my videos or... Come on, come on, man. Damn, man. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right, man, for real. Okay, so I got two elite students right here, and they're not even my students. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, let's go with... Uh... Okay, okay, cool, let's go with this. Um, I was going to ask that question, but I don't want That's too easy for, for Marlita. I was going to say, who was my mentor? Oh. And then you, you, you would have just but said that. Yeah, it's yeah. still a good question. He's amazing. No, no, no but yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess, yeah. Because um, it has to be credit wise. All right, all right. Let's go with this. Okay, I'll, I'll give you a scenario, and then you give me the best remedy. Okay. okay. So, scenario is I have a clean credit profile. I have a clean credit profile. I have... Uh, a three thousand dollar credit card, like one credit card, three thousand dollars, okay, and it's maxed out, okay. My credit card's maxed out, no negatives. I have like one or two inquiries, okay. My credit history is probably like two years, okay. Three thousand dollar credit card maxed out, okay. What would I do to get more credit and try to help me? Get at it because I'm I'm looking for more money. What what would be a, a good scenario of, of me to do so I can get more money? What what would you suggest or what well, well, how can I get more credit if my credit is maxed out? And I talk talk about it a lot because I've been in this situation many times in the past. So it was like it was always my way out. Mm -hmm. So so how would you so? You, you're maxed out on your credit. You're probably using 2800 of 3000 Okay? You want more credit. So what would you do? Could you, you ask for a limit increase? No, they, they'll, they'll deny you because you're, you're maxed out. Yeah, yeah. Which is a good option. If I had only $100 usage, yeah, yeah I would go for a credit limit increase all day. Not okay? So do you, do, you, do you, what do you, I mean, I, I know it's one of those questions where like, it's more like maybe for not beginners, but like maybe a little. Inter I think I. What about trade lines? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So what would you okay. do? So what would you do though? So um, you could. You could do um, well. Authorized user is not quite the same. Well, yeah, yeah. But... Authorized user is a trade line. Okay, then I would I would do that initially. Uh, and and there's like other things you could build on there, but that's more of like AMA and Stellarfy and, and try to get, got it, got you know, 
So, so, so ideally, you would want to get like a ten, twenty thousand dollar credit card, add it to the profile. There we go. So now he goes from hundred percent utilization down to twenty, and then and then from then, then go and try to apply for Correct. either a personal loan, yeah, or something, so you can pay yeah. that off. Yeah. That that'd be the best, right? The best bet. Yeah. Okay, so you got you got the fourth fourth or fifth point. Okay, so. <laughs> Elizalde, you you either this is die, do or die right here, bro. Yeah, yes, sir. Let's go. go. Do or die. Okay. Okay. Cool. So, let's go. Let's go. Let's get it. So, um, all right. Cool. 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 Now, man. Okay. If you have no credit, right? No credit. You're literally 18 years old. No credit. What is that one credit card? I recommend everyone to get first, right? I re recommend this card to everybody. And if it, if you have no credit, it's easy approval for you. You just gotta do something. So, so Lisa, real quick. The question is, you have no credit. What is that one credit card you wanna go to first? And uh, they'll, they'll give it to you because you have no established credit from this bank. And it's not Navy Federal. That's the only clue I can give you. Damn, I haven't been, I haven't been watching for that long. Uh, <laughs> for real. It's uh, a good okay. one. What do you think? What bank? I mean, uh, let, let just... uh, like, like, I don't want to take a loss here. Is, is there any way I can press a, you know, the the random button and get another question? Maybe uh, some a little bit. A little bit. How about this? How about I let you know what? I let you, audience, if you guys can help them out. What is that one? Credit card, so a lot of people are gonna say different yeah. banks. So you got you, you maybe you know maybe the people are are, are kind of new to credit, so they might not. So what bank do I recommend newbie to getting getting their first credit card? And all you have to do is one step, and they'll guarantee you five hundred to a thousand. Let me see audience real quick. He needs he's asking for some audience help. Look at that. They don't want to help, bro, because they don't want to take the L and they'll be like, hey, bro. <laughs> well, I, I'm seeing I'm seeing a lot of Discover. Yeah, I am, too. Oh, shoot, my bad. I'm over here looking at the wrong thing. I thought, okay. <laughs> Discover. Okay, Discover. Um, hey, and we're talking about unsecured credit card, right? Unsecured. No, no, no. We're talking about any credit card. Like, it could be unsecured or secured, but there's there's one that I'm, that I'm, that, that, that I kind of want you to get it first, and, and I'll tell you why. So you can pick one there. They're saying a whole bunch. I I go with uh I go with Discover. Ooh, okay. Okay. I mean, don't get me wrong. New credit card is still a good one, but Discover will probably give you a secured card. The reason you want to go to Chase, because Chase has a rise card. Uh, all you all you have to do is put in two hundred and fifty bucks in the checking and you get approved for it the same day and they'll give you Five hundred to a thousand, like that. Wow. Yeah, my man. I just, I just haven't been watching for that long, man. It's all good, but let me. Get, uh -huh. One thing, real quick. The reason I tell you guys to go to Chase, because Chase has a five twenty four rule, which means you cannot get any credit card with them if you already got five credit cards somewhere else. So if you go to Chase, you're already building that relationship with Chase, and and you're good. Nice. Yeah, wow. got it. Okay, so uh, Marlita, you want 50 bucks and the book? I don't know if you got the book, but uh, DM me, um, and I'll definitely send you that to you right cool. now. Uh, thank you. Like I said, thank you for playing. Appreciate you. How, how long you been uh been following, or how, how did you discover? I mean, you found me on YouTube or Instagram? Yeah, or uh, YouTube first, and then I, I just loved your energy and the way that you treat people and just how straightforward you are. Thank you, thank and you, thank I, you. Like, I gotta, I gotta just get obsessive about this guy, and I've watched as much as I can all of your shorts, all the videos, all the interviews. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you so much. That means a lot. Because uh, honestly, I be filming videos so much, I really don't know who's watching. Because some people Thanks. don't comment, and I'm glad I get to connect with someone that at least been watching the channel and has gotten some value from it. Yeah. You know, and like I said, my main goal is just to. Give back as much and for someone to get that gym and, you know, become obsessive also. Yeah, man, you're phenomenal. Phenomenal. And you, you live so in my old hood. I used to live in Moreno Valley. 
<laughs> oh, nice. Okay, cool, cool. Yeah. And you moved to Denver, you said? Yeah, I'm here now. Yeah. Okay, so who are you going for, Lakers or Denver? Huh? I got to go oh, with the food. Nuggets. Yeah, oh. oh. I've man. been with the Lakers forever. <laughs> A little change. <laughs> okay, okay. All right, Marlene, just send me that info. Thank you so much. Cool. Appreciate you playing. Um, Elizalde, send me your info, too, because I'm going to send you the book, too, okay? <laughs> you going to send me 50 bucks, too? <laughs> oh, not 50 bucks, bro, the book. <laughs> hey, but if, I like uh, it. Hey, but if you're smart, the book can make you 50 bucks. Ooh. Oh, no, 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 I definitely. I I take advantage <laughs> of those those uh, intro introductions. Yeah. Hey, but I'm, I'm re honestly, I'm really impressed with both of you. you. I, I, the last show I had, it was kind of like, oh, shoot. They didn't know as much, but um, I'm gonna definitely save this live and I'm gonna upload it to YouTube. So um, it definitely, you guys, if, if you guys drop your Insta, what's your Instagram so people can follow you? Cause they're about to, I'm about to put it on YouTube and you might get some extra followers. What's your? Mine is uh, Marlita M A R L I T A underscore Ray R A E. Cool. And then real quick, do you have a business, small business? Are you working? Yeah. I no way. I consult for cryptocurrency. I help people learn cryptocurrency and how to trade and things like that. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. We got a little crypto. <laughs> what, what about you, Elizabeth? What you do? Oh, man. I, I, you know, I slice and dice, you know what I mean? Um, some things I can't put on the internet here. Wow. Wow. This guy. Hey, she could have said crypto and she said it too, so it's all good. No, 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 nothing, nothing illegal, man. I just got to keep it private, you know? Oh, I got you. It's kind of. For sure. Yeah. I it's appreciate awesome. that. Thank you. All right, man. This was awesome. But have a good one, guys. And then definitely DM me. I'll take care of that, and I'll put this on uh, YouTube. All right, guys? Thank you so Go much. On. Bless Bye. up. Thank you. All right, guys. Real quick, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm going to go ahead and pay them out. And then I'm going to upload this to my YouTube so it can get, you know, more, you know, more love, more traction. Appreciate you guys uh, following, and uh, thank you so much.